In the heart of Nigeria, in the village of Umweke, nestled between rolling hills and lush forests, lived a young woman named Ingozi. Her striking beauty, kind heart, and exceptional cooking skills made her a beloved figure in the community. One sunny afternoon, a handsome stranger named Chubebuka arrived in Umweke. His chiseled features, bright smile, and charming demeanor immediately caught Ingozi's attention. As they met at the village market, their hands touched, sparking an undeniable connection. As news of their encounter spread, the village gossip and mother began to weave tales of their supposed romance. Ungozi's family, the Okoye's respected elders in Imweke, took notice of the stranger's interest in their daughter. Her father, Chief Okoye, a just and fair leader, and her mother, Une, a wise and loving matra, pondered on the stranger's intentions. Chukwebuka hid a secret. He was a prince from a neighboring kingdom, sent to Umweke to find a worthy bride. As he revealed his true identity and proposed to Ngozi, she hesitated, fearing the responsibilities of royal life. Seeking guidance, Ngozi consulted a wise old man called Baba Ojo, who advised her to follow her heart. Obina, a jealous suitor, emerged seeking to win Ngozi's hand and destroy Chubebuka's chances. He challenged Chubebuka to a series of tests, but the prince accepted, determined to win Ngozi's heart. Chubebuka impressed the villagers with his culinary skills, emerged victorious in a wrestling match, and solved riddles with ease. As Ngozi's heart belonged to Chubebuka, she feared the consequences of loving a prince. Chibwebuka's royal family arrived in Imweke, and Ngozi was introduced to his parents, the king and the queen. The queen disapproved of Ngozi, deeming her unworthy of royal blood. But the king saw the love between Chibwebuka and Ngozi, and advised the son to follow his heart. Obina's scheme to win Chibwebuka's chances was exposed, and he was banished from Imweke. The village council convened to discuss Ngozi's worthiness, and Baba Odo defended her honor. The truth about Obina's scheme was revealed, and the royal wedding between Chibwebuka and Ngozi was celebrated with scandal and joy. Years later, Chibwebuka and Ngozi's love story became a legendary tale, inspiring generations to come. Their love proved that all is fair in love and that true love.